Hi guys, Raf Terry here, back with another Legends of Rune Terra expedition video. In this video, I will show you what I believe is the most consistent strategy to reach 7 wins in your expedition runs. Basically, the strategy is to draft and play with Demasha and Freljord as your main regions. The reason why this combination is so strong is because these two regions have a lot of strong cards individually that work well on their own. Um, not only in terms of units, but also in terms of spells. If you like this video, please don't forget to leave a like. If you have any questions, show it in the comment section. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any of my future uploads. Let's begin our first trial. Right off the bat, we have Baron, a very strong champion just because of the regeneration. Chain Vest is an underrated kind of combat spell, the tough. And we have Vanguard Cavalry, a solid 5 drop. I'm above average to above average 5 drop. Then we have Draven, 3 mana 3 3 quick attack and gives you some spinning access for versatility. We have Noxian Guillotine, uh, one of the strongest removals in the game. This is potentially a 9 mana kill 3, three minions or even 12 mana kill 4 minions. And Brother's Bond obviously gives you permanent 2 damage for 2 allies. The Mega Heg Pack with Gangplank. But I think since this is a expedition that has rewards, we'll go with the safer choice which is the Mashian Steel with Garen. So we'll take the, the Mashian Steel Pack here. So for our second champion pick, we have Sejuani, Vladimir, and Kalista. So Sejuani comes with Scar Mother, Virinia, and an Alpha White Claw. These are all 6 drops. And first, we already have our much needed late game drops. And given that Freljord synergizes as well with Demasha, with all the buffs, the combat tricks, and the late game. Overall, I think we take the suit up top here. We have Cythria, the Cloud of Cloudfield, and Vanguard Sergeant for the Mash and Steel. Obviously, Vanguard Sergeant brings uh, uh, has a lot of value. Then we have Scar Maiden Reaver and Loyal Badger Bear. Also, two very good cards. I think we need to take the Vanguard Sergeant because for the Masha can win games. We have two five drops, strong five drops anyway, with Vanguard Cavalry and Garen. Uh, this is tough, but I think I'll take the Dimension Steel pack here. We take the Shield Wall pack here, here, although these cards are not that bad as well. Single combat can be good with Garen. However, I think we need the Bright Steel Protector and the Lauren Protege. We need to take control of the board early. I think we'll take this pack. We need to get some combat tricks right now. We have Omen Hawk. Very strong one drop. I think it's no contest we take the Ancient Evil pack here. Swiftling Lancer obviously is a very good card, but then we have this pack here with Omen Hawk and Averroes on Sentry. Omen Hawk is really strong. I'll take the Omen Hawk. Let's take the Radiant Guardian and Lauren Duelist here. Radiant Guardian is pretty strong. Oh, Fury of the North. I've been looking for this. <clears throat> Cythria the Bold is a strong card, but we really need the Fury of the North right now. I'm gonna pass on Cythria. We need our combat tricks really bad. We only have 3 spells so far. Blag Bubbling Bjerg is strong in this deck right now. And Flash Freeze. Uh, we really need some combat tricks, so I think we have to settle with Flash Freeze. And anyway, it's not that it's not super bad, right? And then we have Bubbling Bjerg. Obviously a plus one in a hand, we draw our strong drops. Next we have Silver Ring Diver and Wolf Rider. We only have one four drop right now with Babbling Beard. So maybe we take the suit up and the Silver Ring Diver here. We really need repost. But these cards are very good too. We can't pass on Omen Hawk and Babbling Beard, I think. We're not even gonna think about taking this pack. So it's about securing our 2 drops and 3 drops with the Suta pack or getting the strong cards in the Dimash and Steel pack. Maybe we take the Dimash and Steel pack here. 
Alpha Wild Claw, you can never go wrong with that card. And we have a combat trick with Prismatic Barrier. Tarkas, the Tribless is a strong card, although we don't want more 5 drops. We definitely pass on this trade. Shen can be problematic since we don't have too many combat tricks to counter him. We need our Omen Hawk if possible. Nice, we got our Omen Hawk. Our Fury of the North. Board control is king. With this, with this game, we will both be looking forward to establishing board control. Yes, Demasha and Ionia, so we have to keep an eye on his combat tricks. We have Twin Disciplines. <clears throat> twin Disciplines, Fury of the North. <clears throat> Especially now that... We take the 3 damage. Especially now that he has 3 mana gems. Probably our duelist. We have Green Fang Warden. Let's pass first, maybe. I think we take the two manage two damage here. So we will defend like this. Yep, we can defend like this. Can we pass? Nice. Yep. Let's give our Omen Hawk Challenger first. Grizzled Scout. We don't need to capture it. Let's just do this. Then we do this, do this, we attack with everything. Let's attack like this. Let's see if he has any combat tricks up his sleeve. Warrior and life steal this round. Yeah, we're okay, we're okay with this. End the round. Hmm. Just sacrifice this. This is challenger. This will attack for sure. Verinia is better. Or the Shen. Let's pass here. Warships. So Shen gets 6. I'm good with this. I'm good with this. That dies. And lives with 2 health. We pass. Let's do this. Push some damage. I think we're fine with this. We can still summon the... We could have won. We could have won if we used Fury of the North. That was my bad. Foreign Protege as Challenger. Um, let's capture it. I'm not sure if it's it shouldn't summon the it shouldn't summon his creature, right? Yeah, it, it shouldn't summon his creature. We can protect this with Fury of the North. Actually, we will, we will protect, with, protect it with Flash Freeze. So we Fury of the North, or Virinia. Then we Flash Freeze this. We can do this, we Life Steal. Yup, 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 this is the best case scenario. Just all in, of course. I don't think he has any card. Nice. Win our first game. That was pretty good. He played that really well. I would say. 
So we get Fury with Descartes and Battle Fury. This definitely we'll, we'll definitely take this since we don't have much combat tricks, right? So we'll take this. We want our combat tricks. We're up against Misfortune and Quinn. We don't have any good ways of dealing against Misfortune yet. Oh, two Omen Hawks. That's really good for us. We'll get some highly statted cards in the next few rounds. Nice. Oof. Have to get rid of this immediately. We take the 4 damage here. The one damage doesn't make a difference. Let's put out our Fiora just in case he brings out something annoying. And to okay, okay, um, not the worst, but we're fine. At least he didn't get a summon, right? Oh, we can't defend. We actually can't defend against the misfortune. Yep, we summon the protege here. Yeah, you can attack with that. Let's do this. We can do this. We're taking a lot of damage, but I think we're still fine. Go for the plunder play later. Um, he doesn't have any mana left, so we'll just do this. We'll probably defend with his scout. Else, he takes seven damage. Oh, he doesn't defend with his scout. Fine. We don't mind at all. Lauren Prodigy. Someone are started here. Have the misfortune. Let's not get greedy. We don't really need the empty mana gem to play for you. Fine. Get to kill my 1 1. Congrats. Congrats. Let's use reinforcements here. Okay. 6 6. He has to block this. Yep. We're fine with that. Loses the repost. Six six. What's this? Oh. Okay. We just want to put out as many units as possible. can deal with, with that card pretty well. I'm on this guy. He doesn't have a unit. He's yeah, let's prismatic barrier this guy. Oh, not. Nice, we won our second game. Nice, nice. Probably not. Let's take the battle fury. 
I'm only threatened by the Brom right now. Should be able to handle the Palista and the Maokai without too much problems. We drew our Garen. We drew our Omen Hawk. He drew his Omen Hawk as well. He gets a buffed Brom. That will be a problem. Don't have any two drops. We pass here. Skip this block. Our Vanguard Sergeant. Okay, that becomes a 3 3. We're fine with this. Need to do anything yet? He gets the challenger. He'll probably take my Laurent Duelist. It's someone or Garen? I think for sure he has Fury of the North. Yep, for sure he has Fury of the North. So we will play around that. Can feel his Fury of the North already. Summon this. He has Fury of the North for sure. He can pass first. He has Fury of the North 100%. Let's block the damage just in case he has he buffs this. What? Let's summon this first. Let's pass first. Okay. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew he had that card. Yep, yep. Woman Hawk. Maybe I played too scared, but I think that's better than losing the board, just losing the game. This way, I can summon this and for the Masha. Okay, let's use Barrier. We have 3 mana anyway. Summon our Alpha Wild Claw. He has some tough decisions to make now. Let's just block like this. It's fine. Another Omen Hawk. Okay, we we'll use for Demasha and all in. Just use for them, Asha. Okay. 
well played. I did not expect that. I did not expect that at all. Twelve damage in a single turn. Who would expect that? Oh no. That is not a good draw. Place against Cythria. And we don't have any hand traps to protect our Fiora. Okay. That hurts. Come on, Arfiora. Right play right now is to pass. You end around here first. Oh god. Thank god that didn't have allegiance to stake heart. They block like this. Summon the sergeant. Yep. Good with this. We attack with both of this. And we move on with our day. You're happy with that, I think? Mm. Let's do it like this. Back to back. I think we have to burst this guy. We win! Nice! Usually Beastly Champions are really good, but I think the suit up pack is better for our deck. We get a 3 drop, a hand trap, and a radiant garden. We have Fiora, Shen, and Quinn. Um, Vish, Mulligan, all of this. Nice. It's a good card. Good hand to have. Um, we'll summon our Omen Hawk, of course. Pop the two allies in our deck. Then we attack. Rock our Sejuani, but that doesn't really matter too much. Sure. Wow. How will this Fiora will snowball? This Fiora will snowball, man. This Fiora will be super hard to kill. You have a repost in hand as well. We have Bright Steel Protector, we have Repost, we have Sejuani. This is looking good so far. Let's pass first. We'll just repost whoever your challenges. 
another post. Skip this block. Kill that Fiora. Level up the Fiora. Omen Hawk. Omen Hawk won us that game, for sure. But I think we need the 4 Masha. It's a finisher. The Omen Hawks winning us games. <coughs> Problem is with Misfortune. We wanted to mulligan away the Starlet here, but guess we made the right decision not to. We have our Omen Hawk again. We have four Omen Hawks, so. End the round. We have a buff Radiant Guardian. We summon our Starlet Seer. Doesn't have cards. I don't know what other things he will do right now. Nice! Take the back to back. We're at our fifth win, I think. Sometimes that really happens. Got our MVP, Omen Hawk. We don't have any two drops yet, but still have a chance chance to draw one. So don't have to worry much. Okay. Oh, nice summon. Ugh. We just pass here, I think. We're probably fine with passing here. Let's see what he does. I'm okay with this for now. Oh god. You don't have any 5 drops? I think we just do this. We have to. really bad for us. Some of the Omen Hawk. <laughs> That's a tough game. We drew really badly. Didn't have any 2 drops or 3 drops. Could have saved us back there. Yep. Yep, Starlet here instead of Chain Vest would have saved us back there. And not really skiller draft. Okay. This has potential to be another bad starting hand. Going aggressive. We really need our two drops or three drops to come through. Pass. At least we have our Fiora now and repost. Raven. No, we're fine. We're fine. We'll do this. We'll do this. Yep. It 
shouldn't. So this will just be a trade. Which is not too bad, I guess. Four spinning axes. Don't stop. No. Take two damage. Kill our unit. You can summon a radiant guardian. Put on the pressure. We wait another round here. We wait another round. We wait it out. We can repost here. Summon the wild claw. We have four mana for our repost. As ballista. We pass here and just do some trades. He passed. Cool. Take this. Okay, do the arm. I think we're fine with this. Spinning axe on that. Right. We'll repost this one. Yep. Nice. Six wins. We got the six wins. Crown guard. No. Problem mostly lies in our early game. Maybe we take the repost. Yeah, let's take the repost. For the Masha is overall a strong card, so we skip that also. Maybe we take this trade. The more reposts, the better. This choice is intriguing, but I think we skip there. Um, we're gonna shuffle everything except the Vanguard Sergeant. Nice, that's not too bad, that's not too bad. We skip the first turn, but at least we have a 2 drop. Better than nothing. Not too shabby. Elusive card. We're up against Demasha and Ionia. As a Zed Fiora deck. Lots of annoying cards there. Turn 3. Just summon this. How we attack with our Shadow Assassin. Fine. Way. Inflict the three damage. What will he do? Right. Skip the block. And safely summon the babbling beard. Fine with this. Repost. Summon our swift wing lancer. 
have to assume the worst, so we'll just take this. If he has back to back, we do this. He'll just back to back. We lose two units. Shadow ship. We're okay. We're okay with that. We're fine with that. We're fine with that. Grizzle Granger. Let's do it like this. We'll end up just doing that. Okay. Worked out well for us. Just summon this. I don't think we need the life steal now. Maybe we do. We clear the board really for the Masha. This is the play here. Oof! Clutch the eye. They die and he summons lots of war force. Nice. Uh, we pass here. Good play. That was a good play by him, for sure. Got this though. Summon her in here. Summon her in here. Have a repost. Of course, we do this. will die this round anyway. At least we stop him from attacking. This way. gonna do this Boos has most of his cards it's really good for us he might have just one he might have just one have 11 mana we use this Garen the safety here we do this you guys have 11 mana Use this. Down to three. Let's do it like this. See how he reacts first.
Seven wins! Winner! We got the seven wins in our first ex expedition of the week. Nice! Wow! Seven wins again. As you saw in the video, this strategy is relatively easy to play. Basically, you just have to keep in mind to control the board early and mid and you can finish things off with your late game cards. Personally, I've gotten lots of 7 wins from using this strategy with Demasha and Freljord. And at last, if you like this video, don't forget to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Also, it's very important that you hit that notification bell so that you don't miss any of my future uploads. Thanks! Bye-bye!